she was full of life. She was always cheerful. She was a really good sports girl, fantastic runner. She, she could have gone a long way. I miss uh, everything about her. Debbie Ashby disappeared 36 years ago. She was the first missing persons case I ever reported on, and it's stuck with me ever since. Why would a good girl from a great family run away? And what happened to her? Did she simply start a new life somewhere else? Or was she the victim of something more sinister? To find out, I'm going back to speak to Debbie's family. I wanna know how they've coped all these years, and if there have been any new developments. The disappearance of Debbie Ashby in 1987, two days after her 16th birthday, devastated her mother Mary. Every day since has become a reminder of a young life lost and precious moments that Debbie missed out on. Christmas Day, Mother's Day, her birthday, the other girls' birthdays, <laughs> when grandchildren are born, she's not around, when my parents came out to Australia, there's so many. Mm -hmm. Now all these years later, Mary believes she may have finally found a possible explanation for her daughter's disappearance. As soon as they started finding those bodies in the forest, um, I thought immediately Debbie might be one of them. Schmidl was the next body to be found, followed by the German backpackers Gabor Nugebauer and Anja Hubschied. All the victims had been shot or stabbed to death. I believe Ivan Malat was involved. I believe he's the one that um, took her. I've always thought that. I hoped upon hope that when he got sick before he died, he would speak up, own up to, because I believe there's many more. Um, I, I was really hoping he'd speak up, but he didn't. Malat died in prison in 2019 after refusing to give any details about his crimes to police. He has long been considered a suspect in a number of other unsolved missing persons cases. Mary says she's been haunted by the thought of what happened to Debbie for 36 years and now feels she may have some kind of answer, even if it's not the one she wanted. I was one of the people that was sad when he died because he was gone and we'd lost our chance. I wanted him to, to live and think about it. 